Imagine the rushing streets of Tokyo, Japan, where punctuality is more than just a courtesy. It's a way of life. Here, the culture is steeped in a deep respect for others, and harmony is valued above all. The Japanese practice omotenashi, a unique concept of hospitality that anticipates the needs of others before they are voiced. It's a culture where silence is not awkward but appreciated as a moment of reflection. Now let's traverse across the globe to Italy, a place where life is lived with passionate exuberance. The Italians believe in la dolce vita, or the sweet life, a concept that encourages savoring the simple pleasures of life. Unlike in Japan here, emotions are openly expressed and lively conversations fill the air in bustling piazzas. It's a culture where food isn't just sustenance, it's a social gathering, a celebration of life. And then there's the Maasai tribe of East Africa, living in harmony with nature, a world away from the skyscrapers of Tokyo or the vineyards of Italy. The Maasai's culture is tied to their cattle. They believe that their god, Enkai, gifted them all the cattle in the world, making them a symbol of wealth and prosperity. It's a culture where color holds deep symbolism and vibrant reds, blues, and purples adorn their traditional attire. But what about the nomadic Bedouins of the Middle East, who thrive in the harsh desert landscapes? Their culture is built on a foundation of hospitality, a necessity in the unforgiving desert. A guest is considered a blessing and is treated with utmost respect and generosity. It's a culture where storytelling is not just entertainment, but a way to pass down traditions and wisdom. So, what have we discovered on this cultural journey? In Japan, we've seen a culture that values harmony, respect, and a unique form of hospitality. In Italy, we've explored a culture that embraces the sweetness of life, values emotional expression, and celebrates food as a social event. In East Africa, we've learned about the Maasai's culture, where cattle are symbols of wealth and color holds deep symbolism. And in the Middle East, we've delved into the Bedouin's culture, which values hospitality and uses storytelling as a means of preserving their traditions. But remember, these are just glimpses. Every culture is a complex tapestry woven from thousands of years of history, tradition, and experience. They are ever evolving, shaped by the past and molding the future. So, as we continue to explore, let's remember to celebrate these differences, for they are what makes our world a fascinating place to live. The world is indeed a stage, and each culture a unique play unfolding. So keep exploring, keep learning, and remember, the journey is just as important as the destination.